Hello. Hi, everyone. G'day. <laughs> We're the Venus twins from Australia, Georgie and Claire. Welcome. How are you going? We're just doing a short video today, giving you an Australian update on some very important news that has happened in Australia. If you haven't already heard, I'm sure you all have. Uh, that Elvis has left the building. <laughs> I was going to say, someone very important has just left the building. Mm. Um, so we did a channeling yesterday, the 27th of September, which was that significant day here in Australia, and asked a bit about what was going on in Australia at this time. And this so, is from the Arcturian Council, mm. who are starting to uh, come into our, our lives uh, a, lot, a lot more regularly, actually. So this is um, uh, similar to the... Uh, energy that we receive from the Andromedan Council um, and it's a very interesting message mm -hmm. so we'd all first like to just mention um, about our webinar that's coming up yes on the 2nd of October which is a Monday here in Australia at 12 30 p.m. so the middle of the day here in Australia um, it may be a different time if you're in another time zone, obviously, like the USA, it will probably be Sunday evening, the 1st yep. of October. So if you'd like to click on the link below this video to find out more or to register, um, it will be a live Q&A chat with us just to get together of like-minded souls. Our completely tribe. free, completely free. Yep. And just general information from the council having a chat answering your questions just a get together so consider it just a fun get together um if you would like to join us please do we'd love, love to see you there yeah. so the link Wonderful. is underneath this and it's also on all our social media there is a, a post about it uh, on telegram insta facebook just click on the link mark tree atwood posted it for us thanks mate yes yes <laughs> and who else do um, uh I don't know. Anyway, Nathan did. Thanks, oh, Nathan. thank you, Nathan, Francis, yeah. self-sabotage. So just click Nathan. on the link tree link that is on that ad for it and you'll be able to register for it if you'd like to or you'll be able to see the link there for getting onto it on Sunday or Monday whenever that is the right time for you, wherever you are in the world. But it is mm -hmm. Monday, 2nd of October, 12.30, Australian Eastern Standard Time. See you then. Beauty. All right. Good job, Georgie. So... Here is the channeling, and this was uh, channeled yesterday from the Arcturian Council. Australian update, to th September 27th, 2023. Okay, so there is a trigger warning here at the beginning. The information is a little bit dark, but please uh, stay with us because the it becomes much lighter towards the end. We're not usually bringing forth such dark words for example, that you will hear, yeah. but please um, just hold on to your seats and you should be fine. Mm, okay. It gets better. <laughs> okay. Uh, an evil man has been symbolically taken down from his imaginary perch today. DA is no longer the big P of Victoria, Australia, but he has been dead for many, many years. The original DA, Satanist, dark occultist, member of Satanic family and the 13 bloodlines of Cain. Torture master, child rapist, sadist. Evil is not a strong enough word for this person. We would rather not use his name for it holds such a low vibrational frequency and it may interrupt the channeling. But for the purpose of the channeling, we will use his name as Dictator D. Yes, he is gone, but the next, excuse me, but the party ruler next in line is equally as evil, but presents as a smiling assassin. And it may very well be J.A. We cannot say yet, because that hadn't been announced actually but if so this woman is also satanic and from the satanic bloodlines and has a personality so narcissistic that anyone who dares step in her way and tries to anything to thwart her decision-making process processes will be actioned against immediately 
So there is not much hope as yet in this dual party political system. We urge the people of Australia to unite together and form their own communities and find a commonality between their communities and join hands amongst each other. And then, only then, will the future of the people of Australia be completely free. The wishful thinking of a new Prime Minister or a trusted dual political party system working in the favour of we the people is just that, wishful thinking. We are not convinced at all that there is a truly sovereign being amongst these people in power currently. So in saying that and offering that information, we do not see a change in government happening within this year, nor the following. However, the momentum is gaining such traction as to where the next governor may be taken down. So when this happens, the governor of Australia, then things will definitely take a change in direction. Here you go, Georgie, go on from, from there, please. Yeah. The governor general holds the key to your country's freedom. Taking this role away will be the key to Australian freedom and sovereignty and awakening. The people are yet to awaken, but there are powerful energies entering the universe now, and it is spoken about in the Bible, and the Bible reads in revelations of the end times, and the end times are here, and it is happening. We are all changing and experiencing the end times, but the end times are not the end. This is the most important point that we wish to press here. Do not feel that you and your families are going to perish and die in some horrible kind of apocalyptic event. It is not going to happen this way. It is much more gentle. We have a loving, living God who has love for humanity and a divine plan that spiritually enhances those who make choices in service to others rather than in service to self. So follow that pathway, beautiful souls, and know that your galactic brothers and sisters are here watching and waiting and assisting with the Earth Alliance and all of the Galactic Federation of Light members and galactic councils all involved in service to humanity and the Earth's ascension. There is much support. Open your hearts. Feel the love vibration. Love each other. Do not fear the lower vibrational entities and energies. All is being dealt with at the right moment and the right time in accordance with the collective consciousness. So time is of no real essence nor importance. It is all happening now, beautiful souls. Stay focused and stay in the love vibration. Connect the head to the heart. Connecting them together and not separately is where you find the balance and the harmony and the joy and the peace. I love that. So join hands and form your communities and adopt strong leaders in these smaller communities whom you can trust to inspire and educate and help people to follow their hearts rather than the mass media circus. Mm -hmm. This is key. Leaving the old behind and creating the new. All the luck in the world is already yours. So do not feel that you need luck given to you for it is already yours and it is already within you, within your hearts and within your souls, brothers and sisters. Arcturian beings saluting you and Godspeed, in love with humanity and in God we trust.